always tracking, always alerting. Storm Team 8. All right, starting off with temperatures, you notice that there's only 132 on the board. That's Big Rapids, and that's the only spot that it's snowing. We have air that's coming out of the northeast, and it's dry air. So that really helps when it's running into rain because that cold, dry air wedges itself at the surface, and it allows for evaporative cooling and snow accumulation. So Fremont, Greenville, Ludington, Muskegon, Grand Rapids, all several degrees above freezing and not seeing any snow. In fact, there are only areas like the county of Muskegon and the far northern portion of Ottawa County, like Grand Haven, that are seeing rain, and even that is going to be wrapping up here shortly. So we truly aren't expecting too much from this system unless you live in Big Rapids. <laughs> Again, you guys are the only ones that are picking up snow this evening along with Reed City. But you can see the bullseyes of precipitation are rolling into that cold air wedge. So this is just a prime example of how the weather in West Michigan is so interesting, especially city by city and town by town. All it takes is a little microclimate to produce a good one to three inches of snowfall just in that area. But here's what the rest of us are dealing with. Cloudy sky Guys, absolutely temperatures in the 40s really isn't all that bad outside because the wind is fairly light the wind is going to stay light again tomorrow pretty quiet day for Wednesday but notice what happens on Friday we are expecting a system and the certainty on this is getting more and more clear remember every day that goes on the certainty increases when we get closer to a storm system so the same thing goes for next week it now looks like we could be seeing a decent system timing and placement likely on Tuesday we'll continue to update you on that it's further out so the certainty is a little lower but I want to start narrowing in on some of the specifics for Friday system there's still a lot to be decided but it's looking more and more likely that we are going to be seeing some snow accumulation and right now it does put the center bullseye over the West Michigan area. So we are going to have to fine tune this forecast as it gets closer, but here are some of the certainties. The first, the timing. It really does look like it's going to land on Friday. So when the system rolls through, Friday is the timeline. Now two things that still have to be decided, placement and the type. Right now placement showing most of West Michigan impacted. And right now, the type showing mostly snow. But because we're not completely in fine alignment with some of the forecast models, we're not ready to pull the trigger on that yet as a 100% go. Still, if you have plans on Friday, keep that in mind. As for tomorrow, mostly cloudy day. Not bad, though. 43 for Howard City, 43 for Greenville. Ravenna, also 43. Should be hitting a lot of low to mid 40s across the region. So Wednesday, pretty tame day. Winds out of the north at about 5 miles per hour. Saugatuck, 45. Grand Rapids down to Kalamazoo, anywhere between about 45 to even 48 degrees. So a little on the warm side as technically a warm front rolls through. Here's the future cast. You can see the slug of moisture delivering big rapid snow moves out. And then Wednesday, just a lot of clouds, but dry. Thursday, we're also on the dry side. Again, it's not until we get to Thursday night into Friday that we start to see that system. So mostly snow. We will fine tune it every forecast that we put out here. And then next week, again, next big system, potentially Tuesday into Wednesday. So at least we have the timing down. I always like that. And then we can wait to see as those nice specifics like the big rapid snow today come together. Yeah. Exactly. Mm -hmm. Yes, it's all the timing. It is. All right, Ellen, thank you. Yeah.